Every loot crate I get, I'm so excited. Every loot crate I get, I'm so excited, yeah. All right, guys, I just got my, damn. <laughs> All right, guys, I just got my loot crate, Marvel, Gears, and Goods box. You know, I was thinking it was Gears and Gods. I was like, man, that's a weird name. But then I read again, like, a couple months later, and it's Goods. So we're gonna see Gears and Goods. We're gonna see how good it is. How sweet it is to be loved by... Oh, that had nothing to do with nothing. Whew, need my keys. Ah. Got them. Alright, somebody wanna send me something that I can open up stuff with? Feel free. But y'all know how I do with the keys, you know what I'm saying? So let's open this up. You know, I thought that the carrier is just messing with me because I feel like every time it says it's delivered, it ain't never there to the next day. And then with my DX box, they delivered it like downstairs. I'm like, why? But got it today though, guys. So let's crack this mug open. All right, when you, so Marvel Gears and Goods, that is a bi-monthly subscription by Loot Crate. Um, if you want to subscribe or you want to sign up for this one, I will put the information at the, at the bottom. And if you do, you will help me out if by clicking on the link in the description. All right, guys, here we go. Once you open up your, I'm talking about next month, but your, this is what you're going to see. Boom! What we got? 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 What, 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 what? All right, all right, all right. Let's see. Interesting. I'm going to just start with the first thing that looks like Marvel. And it is Loot Crate Presents Marvel Gears and Gods Top Rack Dishwashers. Wait, hold on. What the hell is this? A Hank Pym measuring glass? I guess I should show you guys. So... Looks like we got uh, Flash and all them on there. I don't know all the rest of their name, but it's a cool box, but I don't need no measuring glasses. I I everything. I don't need no measuring glass. You need measuring glass? I'm a I am a top chef. I am a five star hotel chef. I don't need no measuring glass. All right, so got a little slit in here. So that's what it looks like, guys. Measuring glass. Um, yeah. So that was that. So let's uh, we'll go ahead and move on. All right, let's go to the next thing I see. And Modoc. Ice mold. Um, you guys see that? Mold dock. Can you see it? Not really. Huh? <clears throat> Let's see what this is. Oh. <laughs> Because I'm like, you pour the water in there, and then what? How do I get the ice out? But, voila. Now you have an ice mold of this Modoc thing here. You know what this reminds me of? It reminds me of that, I guess I don't know his name either, but that creature from Ninja Turtles that has, like, the head or the, the brain inside his belly. That's what this reminds me of. But, there it is, guys. Put the whole, put the... Put the water in the hole, put it in the hole, and um, split it open, bam, you got some ice. Alright, next item, oh, let's see, we got a pin. We got a pin, uh, we got a pin, roll call, I say a pin, yeah, yeah, a pin, roll call. Sorry. Uh... Yeah, so we got a pan of Ultron. Kind of cool. I don't have one of him. 
He's not my favorite character. You know, I thought I would like him more, but I don't like him at all. But I don't have any pins of him, so it's kind of cool. Uh, let's see what this is. Please don't be an apron. Please don't be an apron. Please don't be an apron. Because I'm a top chef, y'all. I don't need no aprons. I don't need no aprons. I don't need no, I don't need no measuring cups. I got this all day. Wow, it's an apron. Of what? Oh, snap, son. Of, of uh, Black Panther? Shoot. I might have to apron it up. You know what I'm saying? Barbecue this summer. Barbecue at my place. Oh, 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 oh. Sorry, I don't know what I'll be thinking about sometimes. I think I just like being on camera, and then I just, like, be goofy. I don't know. But we got Black Panther. I feel like I've seen this before, but maybe I haven't. So Black Panther, apron. Everything has a like loot or loot crate Marvel gear gods. So it's almost like it's exclusive. I'm not really sure. Um, it doesn't seem to be licensed. I don't see like any stickers. Or any stitching. I mean, all they did. I mean, maybe this is licensed enough. Licensed. I don't know. But that's kind of cool. You don't really get too many uh, African American things in these boxes. So Black Panther all day. Hit him. Next item in the box. Let's see. Oh, falling over. All right. So we got this little box here. Super Science Plate Set. What is this? Is this, is this uh, Marvel for, like, cooks? For chefs? So now we got a plate set. Wait. Wait. That, that was going to work way better than I thought it would. Okay, well. So we got Spider-Man, Spider-Man. Then we got Iron Man. Then we got Incredible Hulk. Why are you smiling though? You smiling? That ain't no Hulk smash type of look. You supposed to be frowning, yo. And Ant Man. I wasn't a fan of Ant Man. I know everyone liked that movie, but I just didn't. Um, just. Just a little info about me. I don't know. Uh, yeah. So, <laughs> this is, it must be, I, I don't know what the theme was. Let's see what the theme was, guys. <sighs> Super science. Super science. Um, the most brilliant minds in the Marvel Universe are using pure, unadulterated super science to solve everything. Everything, and I mean everything. In your kitchen, of course. Enhance your culinary experience with the advanced home good technology contained within this crate. Here you can build. All right, so we got a Black Panther apron, which we know. We got a Moldock ice mold. We got a Super Science plate set. We got a Hank Pym measuring glass. And an Ultron pin. All right, so let's just do some, some uh, recap. So um, I paid 50 bucks for this one. This is bi-monthly, so it's not every month, but I paid 50 bucks for this one. Um, so let's, I guess, do some recap here. Um, we got a pin. I don't know, guys. You guys let me know. Don't let me be just saying stuff. But to me, pins are like a dollar. I wouldn't pay more than a dollar for a pin. So this is a dollar. Let me know what you guys think. Is it $3? Definitely ain't 5 That's what I, That's getting like towards keychains. Um, but I'm thinking a dollar. This ice mold here, 
we have um, I'm gonna give it five dollars maybe it's a five dollar item so we had six um, we have this measuring cup I'm gonna probably give this five dollars it's glass I don't know, I'm just gonna give this five five bucks. I mean, it's not like it's not like thick glass. It's not like they thick glass. If you drop this on the floor, tile, probably even wood, it's gonna break. Um, it's not like that that thick measuring cup that you would buy like from the the store. Uh, so I'm just gonna give this five bucks. That's eleven dollars that we're at right now. Then we have this plate set. In my mind, that just works better. Um, they are, they're Loot Crate Marvel license. I don't know if this is like Marvel license, but I don't imagine me paying any more than $10 for this. Um, the quality of it is something kind of like you can get at the 99 cent store. I'm pretty sure. Um, but since it has Marvel and all the, you know, things on it, this looks kind of dirty actually. I don't know if you guys can see. Mm, can't really see, but it's like the ink kind of came off. But I don't imagine paying more than ten dollars for this. Honestly, I'm just to be honest. Um, so we're at sixteen dollars, and then my favorite item in the whole thing, um, this apron. I don't know how much aprons go for. Echo, buy me an apron. So Echo says that these are ten dollars. Now, you want to give it fifteen? You can give it fifteen since it has the Black Panther on it, and it seems to be some sort of Marvel licensed product. So I give you fifteen dollars. So we're at thirty-one dollars, guys. Um. That does not add up. That is not a good box at all. Um, honestly, if I had to rate the box, um, I'm going to give it two stars. And that's just because I got one item that I liked. But other than that, I didn't like this box. I don't know what's going on here. This is, um, I'm very disappointed. I'm going to be honest with you. So I got an apron. That's pretty cool. I got a pin. Which should even should even be really included. That should just be like some extra thing. I got an ice ice box. Ice box. Some plates. Oh, I can't do it. And a measuring cup. Um, yeah. So that was the February Gods and Goods Marvel box. Um, I think the box is more interesting than most of the things in the doggone, uh, box. I really want to color this thing. It's kind of cool. But other than that, it's not worth 50 bucks, guys. I'm, I'm very disappointed. We're at, at $31. Um, I'm not missing nothing. Nothing, I mean, I got everything. $31, guys. All right, you let me know what you guys think. Was this box worth it to you? Is this something that you would want to get? Uh, let me, guys, let me know at the bottom, guys. You know, is this... Were, would you have been expecting more from a Marvel box like that? Or maybe it's always just going to be like little trinkets like that. But that's not worth 50 bucks, I'm going to be honest. So, alright guys, I'm D. Anthony of Break Room Blitz. Peace.